Okay, uh, so I do realize that I'm putting this before my video because uh, as I was going to edit it, I realized that I left the sound off. Um, so I'm going to talk a little bit about what I did here. I was so patient through all of this and I let myself get really enticed by this BB pushing up here. I think it was more of a boredom, please let something happen. And uh, I took it out before it hit my stop. Um, and it was, <laughs> I was like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I allowed myself to do that. Well, then what happened after that was it came back and it made divergence here, which is why I got in. I got out whenever it reached the area here, although I had pretty good anticipations of it going up. It did come up here and reach like three and a half points and I took it out at two. Um, I was playing around with my stop and I was talking a lot about it because I thought you could hear me and I was talking about extended targets. I think it still will go up and hit this extended target eventually, um, especially after you've got uh, MACDs and price leading higher now. Um, so, you know, it wasn't my best trading day, but um, I'm pretty proud that I sat through all of this junk. Well, beep. Let's scroll back all of this junk without doing anything but yeah I was just watching this and I let this little bit uh, entice me and um, I got in a little maybe a tick or two late on that and then um, not that it would have <laughs> followed through um, but yeah so looking for this long trade here and definitely could have gotten a little bit better profits the anticipations of it snapping back we're already there. I think my mind was just I'm exhausted today. Um, so, you know, what happens was it, it did push up. And now here is your first real exit <clears throat> between them all right in this area. So, you know, I had to hold on, held on just a little bit longer. I might have uh, continued holding on as it pulled back. There was no reason to really exit except for... Um, I want to say fear of it pulling back. So, I mean, as I've said, and as you know, I'm human. <laughs> These things happen. And, um, you know, watching this higher time frame really was one of the big things when it slowed down right in here. Uh, where I was thinking, okay, so this is slowing down. It's uh, time to enter the trade. And it pulled back and gave you a little bit of um, some an area here. Um, but really all it did was just hang out until it hit this area a couple times. And I want to also look at the daily chart really quick, um, which shows you it pulled right back down into that EMA and pushed right back off of it. So, you know, um, maybe this is going to go up and make new highs again. I don't know. I'm not a, I'm not a uh, fortune teller, but I am a market reader. So you can feel free to watch my video in silence. But otherwise, um, I hope that you all have a fabulous Monday. And uh, we'll catch you whenever we trade again, which will probably be tomorrow. <laughs>